I'm Dr. Jagdish PC, a senior consultant orthopedic surgeon, practicing orthopedics, general orthopedics, and uh, trauma in the trauma, arthroscopy, and uh, replacements, which includes the knee replacement, shoulder replacement, as well as the hip replacement and specialized in arthroscopy and sports medicine. I've seen some of the patients when they get a you know, ligament tear, that is an anterior cruciate ligament tear, they will try to manage with the medication and um, they will go to take a physiotherapy and uh, they feel very happy after some time. Yes, it is, it is definitely once after injury, once of the swelling subsides, that is the blood clot subsides and surrounding bone edema, what we call the bone swelling after the injury subsides, the pain automatically comes down. They can able to walk without any problem. But occasionally when they get into the uneven surface, they tend to slip off. That is the knee tends to give way. And this is the time where the uh, if, if the only ligament injury had happened, then the second subsequent injury, they will have the other injuries in the knee joint, especially example like a meniscus, which a cushion cartilage within the knee can get tear. So that is the problem when it, you know, it becomes an aggravate the condition wherein they have to undergo the thinning. So the person, if they have got an only ACL tear, can able to walk without any problem. But when they have got a meniscus, they tend to develop with a pain. By strengthening the muscles, they can able to walk, but they cannot go for any contact sports and all. Contact sports like, you know, the football or, you know, the shuttle badminton and all, all these types of a high demand twisting knee can damage the knee if they get injured again.